Yo guys, what is going on? It is Lux here, and in today's brand new video, I'm going to be sharing with you my experience with sleep paralysis. So I'm on summer break, and I can chill wherever I want, so I was downstairs watching Netflix on the smart TV, you already know how it is, and I ended up falling asleep. So I fell asleep for about an hour, and I was having a dream about my grandma's house. Me and my family were there at my grandma's house, eating dinner, so it was probably like a holiday or something, I don't know. And then, and then I woke up. Or at least thought I did. Thought I did. And you know how when you wake up and you can only like squint because it's so bright? Or you get woken up because someone turns on the light and it's so bright you have to like squint? Yeah, that's like how I could see. And I tried to open my eyes fully but I couldn't see any more than that. And I was looking around and I could see my surroundings. And then I heard this voice and it sounded like my grandma's voice and I was home alone. So it really freaked me out because I was home alone, and I forgot to mention that earlier, but yeah. So I tried to move, because if you heard a voice in your house when you were home alone, what would you do? Just sit there and be like, oh, that's just normal. No, you would try to get up and see what that was, but I could only see what was in my eyes view. I couldn't move, and I couldn't move my arms, and I couldn't get up. So I was like, what's going on? And I was panicking, trying to get up, trying to do anything, but nothing would happen. I would sit there doing nothing, and no matter how hard I tried to get up, there would, nothing would happen. Then I felt this pressure on my arm, and I thought, maybe I'm just having a bad dream. And maybe my sister came home, and is seeing me having a bad dream, freaking out in my sleep, and is trying to wake me up. But no, I got out of sleep paralysis, I got up, and there was nobody home. My sister wasn't home, and I checked the clock, and I was only asleep for about an hour, so I turned off the TV downstairs, went upstairs, turned on the the TV and watch Netflix up there because it was kind of freaking me out. So that's my experience with sleep paralysis and it's pretty scary because I heard a voice and I don't know if it was real or not and I was just sitting downstairs sleeping so I don't know. But anyways that's all I have for you guys today. I just wanted to share my experience with sleep paralysis with you guys. So leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new. I'll talk to you later. Peace. I'm doing this after the video but if you guys saw that Black Ops 3 is having a double crypto key reward for the daily rewards and they're also doing a 5 rare supply drop bundle for 90 crypto key. I'm going to be grinding for those daily rewards and the weekly one and I, after I earn the weekly and the daily reward I will have enough to open one of those bundles. The bundle is 90 crypto keys for 5 supply drops and normally a supply drop is 30 crypto keys and five of them would cost 150 crypto keys. So that's a great deal. If you have enough, go and get them now. Or if you just want to save them or whatever, I don't really care. But I'll open one of those rare supply drop bundles and I'll feature that at the end of my next video. So thank you for watching.